Hello developers, welcome to Tencent RTC's tutorial video. I am Taylor, the avatar powered by Tencent RTC. Today, I'll show you the explanation of the third advanced feature, callback events in TUI CallKit. If your audio and video calling website needs to check the call status of the user, then follow the steps in this video to get started. We can see these five call state callbacks in the official documentation on Tencent RTC's website, which lists the invocation time for each event. We can gain a better understanding of the specific details through code practice. Step 1. Bind callback events. Returning to our project files, the first step is to bind the callback events using the TUA CallKit component. Step 2. Writing callback events. Okay, now we've bound these five callback events. Let's proceed to write their respective callback functions. Here is the code snippet I have prepared in advance which you can copy and paste into your view project file. You can find them in the documentation on Tencent RTC's official website, trtc.io. These five listener events are for pre-call, post-call, minimize, user kicked out, and call status change respectively. Step three, testing callback events. Next, let's go to the demo section and make a test call. First, initialize the login and then make the call. You can see that this is the callback event before calling, which is triggered and executed before the user is connected. The call status change during the call is monitored by the function handle status changed. Here you can see that the callee status changes from dialing to calling, and its calling type is a video call. Finally, after the call ends, a callback event after calling is triggered, and it prints call kit demo after calling. And that's it. You've successfully added the observers into your calling website to listen to various call statuses within each interface. We hope this tutorial video helped you to perform appropriate and accurate handling. For more information and resources, visit our official website, trtc.io. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment. Welcome you guys to subscribe to our channel. Happy coding!